Yes. Oh, yeah. Hey, how's it going? It's Vulture Culture, Alex Dalliance. You can see some flickering behind me. That's because I have the sense on. It's kind of, you know, jamming out while we're getting the stream going. How's everybody doing? Oh, no, Nikki. That's horrible. I'm sorry to hear that. How's it going? Vulture Mom, hello. How's it going, Neil? Nikki, Ryan, Tiffany. How's everybody doing? Yeah, I got some sense, you know, doing a little of this action. A little of this right here. Always fun to touch the keys. Sipping wine, munching veggie crisp. Well, that sounds like a perfect time to do a little toast. Got this sweet Hornito seltzer. Pop this bitch open in front of all the expensive electronics. Anyways, scum family, love you guys. Let's fucking do it. Mmm. Cheers, ha, ah, delicious. So, yeah. No new ones yet, Nikki. Two new ones coming eventually. You can see that one's having fun right there. Lots of lots of LEDs moving. Um, so anyways, tonight we're playing Donkey Kong Country 2, 102%. So I got that up over here. And um, let me go pop up my uh, bookmark real quick. I forgot to get that going. So we've got the things we need for what we're doing. But uh, we're more or less, yeah, prost. Uh, more or less ready to get going here. So, uh, let's back up. Ooh, what's going on? Oh, let's go back. Ah, that's not what I wanted. Ah, no. 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 All right, let's, uh, how do I... Uh, there we go. That's what I was looking for. Let's jump on in. Cheers, guys. I love all of you. We're getting it involved. <laughs> Anyways, it's a beautiful game. Going to be a lot of fun tonight. Let's jump on in. 22% done, guys. Already rocking and rolling. Let's see where we're at here. We haven't gotten a lot of shit yet. Red Hot Ride, let's jump in. Feeling a lot better this week, sorry about last week. Sometimes things are gonna happen. Oh yeah. Hey, coins, that's useful. So how's everybody doing? Fuck. Let's get get the party started. So this is the balloon level. This one's tough. I think we all remember this one from childhood. Yeah, here we go. It's actually Diddy's Conquest, like one word. Um, like it's a pun. Are you kidding? That was hot jank. I don't know why I thought there might be something down there. Yo, what's up, Chad? How's it going, buddy? Can't believe it's already April 20th. That's pretty bizarre. There we go. Oh, yeah, here we go. Just starting the stream off with all the power that you guys were excited for. So yeah, for those of you guys who don't know, Scum Night every Wednesday going live on YouTube. Tradition. Powerful. Yeah, it's good. And um, I was a little sick last week, so we called the stream a little early. But uh, I intend to get some good progress done today, so I'm excited about that. Love this game. Definitely the best of the DKCs, arguably. Aw, oh, man. Did 
Did any of you guys play this game growing up as a kid? I think I asked that last time. I think Ryan said he he was done with the minecart level and basic. Ooh. Wow, I, I risked a lot for a coin. I think we need to go talk to Swanky. Let's go get going here. Video game heroes, you say? Well, that's great. Hit the button, let's play. All right, Lucky Lava. Let's see how much I know. What colors were the crocodile heads you jumped on the first level of the thing? I think there were red and green, I thought. These are not options. Let's try blue and green? Nope. All right, let's try it again. Red and blue? Gosh darn it. So it's gotta be green and brown. What is an extra lives balloon colored red worth? One life. Let's have another. Excluding the end of the area boss, how many levels were there on the first area of the island? Six? Ah! And I'm out of coins. Gosh. This is rough. It's rough, guys. Hoping to get some lives. It's not looking good. I can't even go up there. Let's see, can I get up there if I do one of these? Nice. That'll actually help. I need those to get some swanky action. Oh yeah. The taste of freedom, baby. <laughs> How's it going, my boy, Andy? Missing you, brother. Ah! Let's try to not be terrible this time. What's new, buddy? How's Orlando treating you? Good old Orlando. All right. Oh, maybe we can get it this way. Oh, that's definitely the intended way to do this. Nice. All right, let's sink a little. Nice. And then we'll go up. So guys, uh, till the end of the month, I'm going to be playing this game uh, pretty much, I don't know, I don't know if non-stop's the word, but you know, we'll be playing it good. Well, mate, ah, not good, but just playing it, you know. Um, food is great, traffic is terrible. Where's the hotness up there? Next time we're up in Orlando, Andy, where should the scum family go? That's what we got to know. Not I-4. Urge you on that. Do you remember, it wasn't that long ago that Orlando had terrible food, too. It was like a food desert, and now it's like bumping. The music is great. So, uh, since the last stream, I bought... Well, that was interesting. I didn't know you could do that throw a Kong through the level like that. No I-4 and no I-Drive. Good old international drive. Clogged with tourists. Did you guys see the descent? I don't want to get into politics, but just, you know, DeSantis is trying to take away Disney World's, like, all their power because of the uh, Don't Say Gay bill. And I guess Bob Chapek's opposition to that even though he donates uh, regularly to Republicans, he uh, decided that was uh, too far. Interesting. DeSantis turned around and called Disney a woke corporation, which is kind of funny. Why am I even bothering? That's the real question. Let's just do that. That was so much better. Yeah, but where's the hotness, Andy? Yeah, I'm not trying to get into name-calling, Neil. I mean, I understand, like, we're all passionate about stuff. Here's the thing, like... You know, they say don't talk about politics, but I'm scum daddy. I'm gonna do whatever I want. And, uh... My thing is, is that there's, I know, I know good people who are conservatives, good people who are, you know, uh, 
liberals, good people who are Christians, good people who are atheists. What the fuck are you even supposed to do here? Wow. You know, it's, it's important to recognize that a lot of these boundaries between people are cultural, where you grew up in the world, where you live, who you know. I try not to, like, make fun of people because the truth is, like, that's not what I'm trying to do. Um, what I will say, though, is, like, certain, you know, obviously it's fair to talk about policy, what you'd like to see more of or less of. You know what's funny is when you get people talking about just, like, what they'd like to see, a lot of conservatives have much more liberal ideas than they realize about what they'd like the government to do for them. And same thing with, with liberals. Oh god, this is terrible. It's falling balloons. My point just being, like, we all gotta come together sometimes. Focus on the good. Cool, Andy, cool. I don't know, I'm just rambling because I'm just stuck on this fucking balloon over a lava pit. I mean, look at this shit. This is horse shit. Hot horse shit. Ah! Okay, we're good. Oh, yeah. This level is going to be really annoying. Oh, I see what I'm supposed to do. Just so I can get some bananas. Yike. Cheers, guys! We got a level done. That was good. And let's go back to Swanky now. And party on. Alright. We got two coin. We got plenty of coins now. Green and brown. One. I think there must be five. There we go. Got some lives. Let's go to Gorilla Game. How many banana bunches would you have to collect to get an extra life? Uh, ten, right? Boom. Where did the beetle first appear during the first area of the island? Level two, I thought. Nice! What is the name of Diddy's ponytailed girlfriend? Dixie. Boom! I like that Didette was a fucking choice. Alright, we got all the games complete, got some lives. That was helpful. Didn't they do well? Red Hot Ride. All right. Squawk Shaft. Love a good shaft. Oh, sugar. One of these levels. Uh, looks like I might be able to get... <laughs> this looks like such a trap, doesn't it? <laughs> Why? Why is that even there? Talk about a waste. Coins are worth so much less than lives. I do like that they bumped up the size of the K's in this game. Or the Kong letters, I should say. Alright. Check out this pre pre precision platforming, guys. Epic. Alright, here we are. See, this gameplay is probably not that entertaining, because I'm both bad, but not as bad as I was at Super Mario World. So it's not quite as entertaining as when I'm just truly trash. That is... Ooh, never mind. I do see a point of going for that. I wonder what was in there, guys. Ooh, we need to save. Guys, don't let me die lifeless without saving, okay? Appreciate you. You know what? Fuck you. Nice! Well, it's not really worth dying for, though, is it? Hey, this is cool. Neat! Fuck yeah. Ooh, I can hear a problem here. Why don't we just turn these off? Real quick. Sorry about that buzzing sound. 
That was the sound of all these synths. Might as well shut them off too while I'm thinking about it. Oh yeah. Ah! I forgot where the power cord is on this guy. There we go. And there we go. Alright. Synthesizer's off. Alright guys, check out how fucking great I am. Oh yeah. You know who's really great though? You guys. Those of you guys who show up every week and check this out. That's true greatness. True heroism. Alright, let's see what's going on over here. Yes! Finally a bonus level! I thought I was going to fly into it. So yeah. I need some updates from some people about what their lives are like. Come on, hit me. Fuck my shit up with some truth. Wow, that's only the O. Hey, check it out. It squawks the parrot. I think in the first game he just held the light, right? Ah, oh, we can shoot eggs. They don't do anything against the red guys. Ooh. Well, this is dangerous. Hey, Pinto, how's it going, brother? Just getting some uh, nice platforming in tonight. Ah! Hot garbage. Wow! Can you believe we did it, guys? Ah! Vultures are a problem. Nice, you can get him through the... Wow. Ah! Oh, oh, yeah. Calm and collected. I was a coxswain yesterday on an eight man. Can uh, care to define what a coxswain is, mother? For the for the chat. What's new, Michael? All right, we really didn't get a lot done. Let's go ahead and save. I want to save. Yeah, how how's Duke Nukem 3D going? Which, by the way, guys, go ahead and Pinto, if you don't mind dropping your Twitch link in the chat i would appreciate it drop that motherfucker because um everybody should be following you you're streaming a lot more hey how's it going autumn tell me the truth autumn what's new don't lie to me okay let's go and see where we need to go all right we're going all the way back all right we're good there i can't remember did we Okay, let's go. Well. I don't think we... Let me see how they did this. Anyways, let's go ahead. Sorry, I was just reading. Let's go. We got... All the bonuses in Cannon's Claim, but we didn't get the DKC coin. Let's see. At the start of bonus area one, do a helicopter spin. Jump to the right to find it. Okay. At the beginning ledge, do a jumping helicopter off the right. All right, so that's what we got to do. They hid this motherfucker in the bonus level is what it looks like. Oh, that's not what I was trying to do. Fuck. Let's get back in. 
This is 102%, guys. What that means is, is every bonus coin in the game. And there are a lot. But we've already beat this bonus, so what we're really trying to do is get that. Done. All right, we got the DKC coin. Lava Lagoon. We didn't really get a lot, did we? Okay. Swim down to the right of the last clapper. Get the invincibility barrel and swim as fast as you can to the right and get to the hero coin before your invulnerability disappears. Okay, bonus area. After the no unguard sign, pick up the barrel you see and chuck it at the large crate to your right. So we're looking for a no unguard sign. Um, all right, so that's what we're going for. And then just the last clapper with that invincibility barrel. Get the invincibility barrier and go to the right. Okay, so that's actually kind of nice. We don't have, we just play the level normally until we get probably through the halfway point. This level with the lava is so stressful though. Where's our girl in guard at? That is not worth it. What am I doing? All right, let's go. For God and country. Oh, I didn't mean to do that. That just kind of happened accidentally. Well. Not worth it. I swear, none of the things in this game are worth it. Coxon is a short person that sits in a small place in the back of an eight-man rowing shell, steers the boat with two ropes, and by their commands and by their commands to the rowers telling them telling which ones to row. So you're sort of like the daddy of the rowing. So you're coming to town tomorrow, Autumn. Love me some pho. One for the commandment, one for the core. <laughs> Guess the core didn't get theirs. So true. That core though. Ah! What? Alright, come on, Alex. Stop playing that garbage. The people came here to see excellent gameplay. They did not come here to see terrible gameplay. No one here... ...enjoys when I'm terrible. JK, that's what you're here for. <laughs> no one is more sadistic than my own mother at enjoying my suffering when I'm bad at a game. And that's true. Hey, invincibility. Whoa, that was weird. Yeah, come on. I just wanted to kill this guy for no other reason. I wanted it just for that. Okay. We're looking for a no on guard sign. <sighs> Had to eat it. Come on. <laughs> Man, those things are a little sneaky. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We love it when you're terrible. It's true. Well, Eat up these delicious fails, because they're incoming. One good or bad, depending on how you look at it, thing about this game is how fast you mash underwater affects your swim speed. Okay. No one guards, son. Let's see here. Uh, pick up the barrel you see and chuck it at the large crate on your right. All right, let's see. Oh, this isn't too bad, is it? Nice. We gotta kill them all, baby. Oh yeah, come on. Revenge of the fish. Only a fish sees things in extremes and absolutes. What's the quote? Black and white. Hey, hey. nice. So 
So yeah, through the end of the month, I'm definitely... Gosh, that was not incredible gameplay. Through the end of the month, we're... Okay, so what the hell am I doing? Last clapper, get the barrel. Ah! Oh, might have messed it up. Okay, I think this is the last clapper. Maybe not. Oof. You punk ass bitch is what you is. Wait. Hmm. Hmm. Hey, how's it going, Jackalee? How are you doing? We're uh only a only a fish deals in absolutes. Thank you, Ryan. All right, let's get this going. Gameplay. Playing the game strong. Was this the last clapper, guys? I don't think so. I think I got one more clapper. Going to the right. This is the last clapper. Where the hell's to the right? Okay. Wait, wait, wait. If you see these dogs in the front yard, uh, just go uh -huh. upstairs, I'm going hard. Bing bong. Here we go, come on. Oh. That wasn't it. Strange. Here's what it says. DK coin, swim down to the right of the last clapper. Get the invincibility barrel and swim as fast as you can to the right and get to the hero coin before your invulnerability disappears. If that means anything. Everybody loves a good jackaly. The barrel that has a thing in it is the one they're talking about. Sorry, Ryan. I don't 100% know what you meant by that. There is a right section there, but it's not the last clapper. You know, what's funny is I remember finding that the invincibility barrel when we played the game last time. Oh, you see that? There's some shenanigans up there, but not the stuff we need. Ate it right to the face. Okay, come on. Ah. That was a little janky. Oh, yeah. Um, I was saying that I'm going to be playing this game to the end of the month. From there, though, we'll see how far I get. Uh, I intend to kind of keep this DKC series going as, like, we don't have anything else, but I'm going to have, hopefully... Uh, our good friend Emily back on the stream. I've already set up with Gwen to have Gwen on the stream soon, uh, which is exciting. Okay. I would love to have Mighty Pinto back to play Scream Thy Name Betrayer. So those would all be things I would like to see happen next month. The squid though. And by squid, I mean seal. Everybody knows a squid and a seal is the same animal. Okay, guys. Here's the last clapper. What could possibly be the case? Oh, there we go. That was sneaky. Very sneaky. Uh, will this work? I'm invincible. Might as well finish it out, right? 
Nice. Bonus love life. Oh, uh, yeah. So, moving out with Gwen, we're going to be uh, playing Mario Kart 64 with Emily. Love to get uh, Mighty Pinto back on the stream. That was one of the best streams we've ever had. Also, just an amazing job, Maya Cool. Um, what else is going on? Oh, and then I want to be messing around with these synths a little bit more. So what I'm going to do is kind of like the Poly 6 stream, but maybe even a little bit less extreme, not doing an entire song live, um, but just actually letting people hear the sound of all of these incredible vintage synthesizers. Um, they really are great. They really are cool. And so we might be doing some of that. Um, more of that. We got the Prologue, which I did some videos on when I first got it, but I think it's time for an update. SQ80 with the custom controller and Sonic Mirage from 1985, SQ80 from 1987, JD800 from 1991-ish, K5000S, never did a video on that, JP8000, did a video on the Proteus, what else we got? Roland D50, never did a video on, Korg M1, JX3P, uh, and then the controllers for the DW8000 and the Alpha Juno are in too, so we got a lot of content that I haven't done yet for synth stuff, and so I want to get that up on the channel um even though i know it's probably you know some of the scum family are less into since than the, this sort of thing but it's been very good for the channel and it's also more unique you know like any dumb motherfucker can play dkc right uh but not everybody has these really awesome uh, you know privilege to be able to play with some of these synths so Going back to Red Hot Ride. This one's gonna be tough. If you see these dogs Whoa. in your front yard, huh, just know upstairs I'm going hard. Bing bong. Okay, so apparently the DK coin is by the letter N. Remember that bullshit? And then past the first giant sequence of balloons and zingers is a stony slope wall just before the no Rambi sign. Use Rambi uses supercharger break down the wall. R and then the bonus area two is right below the continue barrel. Uh, okay. So that doesn't seem so bad. Kind of can, can kind of handle all of this. That's really funny considering that you work in the moving industry, Ryan. For those of the people who don't know that. They're great friends and then they're friends who help you move. So true. Oh, look at him doing his little, uh, he's throwing the juggling balls. So cute. Oh my gosh. Oh, wait a second. I don't know if that counted as the first big section. I don't think so. I don't think so. Whoa! <laughs> Good thing I saved that life. <laughs> that was rough. Stellar gameplay only, Alex. <laughs> Told my friend the last time I volunteered to help them move. I love my friends, but we ain't as young as we once were, as so in good a shape as Alex. Next time I will help pay to have movers do it. Which is funny because, uh, you know, Zach, also in the same industry, our boy Zach, scum family member, he's, uh, he's told me several times, like, if you ever move, never hire a moving company. I think it's interesting. Boy, I think I almost lost it there. But we're good, we're good. You have a little bit of give here before you die from the lava. Oh my god, I cannot believe we made it. Did you guys see that? That was ridiculous. 
I cannot believe that existed. Not for cross country. Cross town is a completely different story. Yeah, yeah. Hired a moving company. It was great to not have to carry my stuff up a flight of stairs. Boom! In the hole. Yeah, that was pretty crazy. Let's see if I can not mess this up. Let's do it, guys. It's a kind of a joke. This actually game. Oh, maybe I'm not going fast enough. Maybe that's the. Wow, that was freaking easy. That was ridiculously easy. Okay. Ah, oh, hot garbage. Okay, so it's down here, I think. Yep. I thought I was gonna shoot right into that uh, cruncher, or whatever his name is. All right, let's see what. Ooh, this is a problem. It's gonna be a real problem right here. Okay, let's uh, just be good for a second, for a change. Nice. Yeah, Nico's fucking jacked. Tiny jacked. Okay, let me check this out. Uh, use the first key DK peril that I just threw. Oof. Think this will work? Yeah, I should be able to use this. Nice. Nice little cheating here. Oh, oh, wow. Uh, it is crazy how far you could go down. Wow, feels like cheating. Oh, go. It is very, no. It is very hard to take that barrel that whole distance without having it crash into something. That's kind of, kind of hot garbage if we're being honest. All right. Okay. God, it felt good. Oh, who? Beautiful. All right, Squawk Shaft. Autumn says, ugh. They ain't cheating if they put it in the game. That's for sure. All right, let's check out Squats. The Shaft. Everybody loves the Shaft. Bonus area. Oh, there's three fucking bonus areas in this bitch. Bonus area one. Crush the second trio of clumps. Then helicopter spin or cartwheel jump from the right edge of their platform until you land in a barrel cannon. So, second trail of clumps. At the continue barrel, team throw up and into the auto fire barrel to your left. You'll be blasting the bonus barrel immediately. Uh, okay. When you, three, when you see two crooks facing each other after a nasty mini necky flock, bean them both with eggs, then fly up onto the lower right hand platform. Okay, so. Second trio is what we're looking for first. Second trio of clumps. The clumps are the not these guys. The wolf wolf. Why did I make that sound? I don't know. So that's the first trio. Love their sound effects, don't you? All right. Totally screwed that up. That's okay. We could do that again. Nope. Oh. All the way back. Don't worry. Don't worry. Precision gaming. Right here. Back to the beginning of the game. Precision. Perfect play. Okay, here we go. Bonus one. Let's get in there. Fuck your life! This, yeah, mining melancholy is too good.
Oh, what the fuck? Didn't that look like a thing for a second? Nice. Boom. Tornado Seltzer. That was another same shit. After the continue barrel, team throw up and into the auto fire barrel to your left. Well, actually, that was just useful, wasn't it? Like some fucking nice coins and bananas, yeah. Love nice coins and bananas. What am I doing? Precision gaming is what I'm doing. Hmm? Precise. Uh, no! Okay. Everything's fine. Nothing is fine. Ah! Everything's fine. Just calm fucking down, Alex. hate in my heart right now. Oh my god. <laughs> breathe in and breathe out, yeah. Okay, I think that's the one we already got, right? Might be able to get back over there. I was hoping to see if I could, like, fly over there. I thought we already got that one, right? I think we did. Let's see what happens if I don't go... Ate it. Right away. Ugh. <laughs> I love her little cute little laugh. So sweet. I think I got bonus, too. So what was the last one, then? When you see two crooks facing each other, and then the... DK coin 3 is to the right, so okay. We'll just go to the crooks. I think we got that on our first time through. Nope. Ah! Alright, here we go. Really use a DK barrel. What I'm talking about. Stupidity. Hot's impatience and stupidity. Woof! Shot the wrong way. Shot my nut early. Hate it when that happens. Ah! Look at the barrel! It was right fucking there! Ugh. Darn it. Okay. Let's get good at tagging these bitches. I feel nothing. Just calm, collected gaming. Nothing at all. Just executing. That is one seriously perverted bitch. Anonymous! Thank you very much for your $20 donation. I really appreciate whoever you are out there. The donation comment says you're doing great. Hang in there. I appreciate whoever you are. Thank you very much. Okay. Let's see what these bitches are trying to do. Calm patience. Okay. Here we go. Nice. Nice, very nice. Very, very nice.
Ooh, I almost got tagged. Easy every time. Woo! Precision gaming. Hey, did you notice that? Isn't that cool how you have a check mark there? Neat. The rage is real. Okay, so let's double check here real quick. Explanation mark DK. Explanation mark, mark DK. Explanation mark DK and explanation mark. So we're good to go. We're good to save. Let's go ahead and save. 13 coins is nice. Okay, let's leave college just like I did without anything. <laughs> let's go to Funky's Flights too. Let's get in. Ba, ba, ba. Oh, sugar. I thought there was more to, I thought there was more swanky to be done, but I think we already tagged the swanky, didn't we? I think I'm just burning coins. Oh, no, no, Chimp Challenge is still here. Chimp Challenge is still here. In the first level of the game, how many windows did Captain's Cabin have? How the fuck am I supposed to know that? Two? Fuck you, Swanky. Four? Thank you, Christ. On to the next round. What is the name of the first riggin' level? Main, ba main Brace Mayhem, I think. In the first level of the game, which of these objects is not a background object in Captain's Cabin? Sword, map, a gun. I don't think I saw a gun there. I don't want to hear that. Boo -doo. Nice! Okay, we got some extra lives. That was worth it. Let's leave the studio. Until next time, here on Swanky's Bonus Bonanza. Let's burn some more coins on Funky, but it's okay. What's up, bro? Let's smash this goddamn fool. Oh yeah, this is not an easy boss. I remember this one being just brutal as a kid. Ah! You can kind of cheese it a bit by skipping a... Uh... Nice, I wasn't sure if that was gonna hit. Into the lava you go. Is that it? Question mark? Oop. Garbage. Ha, go. Oh. Dude. What? Hey. What? Do you guys see those coins up there? I don't know if you can see them because of my camera. I'll see if I can grab them. Whoever Anonymous is, thank you for your supportive tip. That's what's up. Let's try and play this with Diddy, because when I fuck up and Diddy dies, it'll be easier to finish the level with Dixie, I think. I have a better, although this is, this is stressful. Luckily the, the cannonball sort of loses momentum in the air. Wow. Does it look like I'm good at this game? Anything up here? Nothing really. All right, buddy, come on. See, this is not that bad with Diddy, actually. Some coins up there, come on, come on. Oh, that wasn't too bad. It's also nice, whoa! Oof. What you doing, buddy? Well, that's not really fair. Well, it worked out. I'm gonna miss the coins though, because I should have swapped at Dixie. Come on. Oh, that screws that up. Oof. Oh no. Am I actually gonna get the coins? Nice! Oh my god, I can't believe that worked! I got the coins and cleaver. That was sweet. Better than I am, that's for sure. This game is not easy. You know, you're standing too fucking close to me. 
Creme Quay. Barrel Bayou, okay, so just as a reminder, as a reminder, chat, I know that you do what you do. We're gonna get to um, get to the save point before we try to get all the bonuses and shit. It's nice when we get the bonuses along the way, though. Satsu! Hell yeah. What's up, Satsu Gene? I feel like the power of... <laughs> thought I almost died. The power of God compel me whenever Satsu shows up. Ah, I see how this works. You have to kind of like push the thing. Hey, look at- I love these guys. Look at them go. Hey, we got Rambi. Whoa! You know... That was some... Really deceptive game design right there. I like that he just throws one B and leaves. Hilarious. Okay. Right in the hole. Skipped one. First try. Ah, uh, casually sharing the power of God, apparently. More in the fickle side story, yes. Hey, bananas. Whoop. Interesting. Look, there's a cannon. Going, buddy. Hey, cannonball! That was awesome. That was a crazy bonus. I just kind of followed this. I mean, they, luckily they laid it out a little for you, you know. Is that it? Wow, that was. They gave you a lot of time. They're pretty generous on the timer this far into the game, at least, which is nice. This is so satisfying. What do you guys think? Wow, Alex. <laughs> Not worth it at all. <sighs> and if anything, we did learn that there's another... Ooh, another bonus, at least. <laughs> God, that was sadistic game design, too. Thank God for this. Okay. What? Okay, thank you. Game is being pretty generous on this level. Okay, let's just not go for that again. It's totally, I was like thinking to myself, I'm like, well, I gotta get coins or there's no chance of me ever making it through this. Because I need the lives from Swanky, but that's actually very dumb. Oh, this isn't easy. Oh. 
Whoops. It worked! Where's Emily? I know, where is Emily? How's it going, Annie? How are you doing? <laughs> Not impressive. Not impressive at all, if we're being honest. I was hoping I could get myself back over there. Anon Anon, how's it going? Hello. Wow, we got a while ago. Sucks. Precision gaming. Keep moving. If there's only two bonuses in the level, though, we'll have found them, which is nice. And the DK coins. We don't have to come back to this level. What is it called? A stupid level? I actually kind of like it. Not that bad. It's reasonably difficult. Without being really unfair in any way. Throws a bee? So cute. For some reason, I think it's so cute when the cloaks do that. Uh, can I skip some of this crap? Skipped a little. Oof. God, it's a heart fucking breaking. Okay, I don't remember how I fucked this bonus up. Guys, pray for me. Okay, just be calm, Alex. Just be cool. Everything's fine. Eight seconds. Easy. Easy every time. <laughs> I wanted that one up. Thank you, Anon. Hey! We did it! Don't ever have to go back. Beautiful. Glimmer's Galleon. Love the music for this level. <sighs> Bumping. Go up this. Hey, a bonus. That was easy. <laughs> Not too difficult. Okay. Focus. Focus. Love this song. Underrated. Hey! It's an anglerfish. With a light for me. Oh, by the way, guys. Uh, epileptic war alert. That's right, Anna, they cannot swim. We learned that the other day at Lion Country Safari. They are not swimmers. But these apes, not only can they swim, they can breathe underwater, no problem. Just alpha. But yeah, every time you swap directions, there's a frame where the screen goes bright white. And it can absolutely trigger epileptic seizures, and I believe in later updates of the game, they, uh, they fixed this. Um, but, you know, back in 97 or whatever, this isn't gonna be good. Ah. How's it going, Anna? Woof. You can see how it's going for me. Precision gaming. Hey! The O. But no K. Ooh. Now they're exploding. Hey! Is that a bonus? Oh, I thought it was a bonus. Can we get the... Let's go back up here, though. Wait. Ah! This level's really cool. It's like a giant maze. Oh, wait, no, I'm starting at the beginning. Sugar. I thought I was further along. Okay, that's fine. It's 
Doesn't it awfully seem like that was a hint? Love this little angler fish. <sighs> stress, stress, stress. What am I even doing? Okay. You know what's not cool? Stingrays. Those motherfuckers. Putting Steve Irwin. Fuck you. I'm still mad at them. Although manta rays are pretty. Oh. Hey, a coin. Not going to be worth this death. Ah, sneaked him. Wait, I can't get out. I'm trapped. I am, like, trapped. How do I go this way? Whoa, hey. Hey, wow, that was hot. Ah. Okay, let's see what was up here. Nothing really. First movie with Pikachu cause seizures too? That's a card for your game, really? That's amazing. I guess I was already spoiled. Trying to give me the Irwin treatment. Trying, I really am interested to try and find some, some stuff in this level. I'm intrigued by the maze-like nature of it. Hmm. Seems like I'm just going in circles. Yeah. Oh wait a second. Hmm. No, I think we're good. Halfway. Yeah. <laughs> it is now. Mana rays are awesome. Uh, I don't think I've ever seen one in person. Oh, not these guys. These starfish are dumpster fire enemies in this game. Oh, they're shooting on the angle now. Like a porn shoot. Oh. Yeah, those stars are the worst. Actually, those things are the worst. The lock jaws. The TMJ fish. Mm. Oh, did we, Jackie? That sounds right. I don't think I've, I haven't seen them in the wild, though. Okay, how do we get into the hole? See, they're teasing you. Can we get over here? Nope. Oh yeah. Well, let's go get this first before we try any shenanigans. Hmm. This is not good. Hmm. Interesting how those enemies can like kind of move their location. Unlike other enemies, which are pretty, like, fixed. I'll get to... This is... Come on. Come on, daddy. Come on, give me some... Give me some love. I'm not trying to get seizured out. I'm trying to fucking find the secrets in this game. Oh, they do have them at this aquarium. We saw the whale sharks for sure. I think I just totally forgot about the manta rays. Yeah, it's awesome. It was so sad when they lost the one whale shark. <sighs> How am I doing okay? Oh man, I'm not. God, this is sadistic level design. God, just stay away from me. You sick animals. Oh, and I missed the secrets. Uh, 
Okay. Can that guy fuck with me? Did I tell me I did not come all this way just for a... This is not good. What was this one? Another bonus, yes! Fuck your life! Let's get in here. I'm like collecting bananas because I'm an idiot. It's a maze and I'm like happy to... I think I sense freedom. Unless there was a DK coin hidden in this bonus. Okay. Not up here. It's so... I mean, it is a really cool level. Ah. Uh, it's so hard to know when you're... Got the bonus at least. Uh, a, a lamp fish or a fish lamp? Obviously, a fish lamp. Um, <laughs> it's really cool though. It is a maze. Now that I know, and impatient, I'm gonna eat it. Level does not respond to impatience well. But those pink starfish do, because you kind of need to, like, just get past them. There we go. I got lucky there. Okay, come on, come on, Ali. Oh, yeah, come on, Daddy. Come on. Play with good. Play with good. Great monster over here. This is ridiculous. Okay, that looks like the way to go. Hoping the secret was gonna be a little bit better. Oh, interesting, they won't pop until you get close enough. We did it, guys. That was a really cool level. That was my favorite level so far. It was really um, exciting to uh, get it through. All right, let's, uh, I mean, we can save, but we got lives, right? How many lives do we have? Who knows? Crockhead Clamber. Let's get some more levels done, and we'll go back and, yeah, we got nine lives, so let's go ahead and get that happening. What's up, bro? Very not smart. Okay. So we're hanging off of, uh... What do they call those things? Reeds? That cancelled my jump. But I got lucky. Hey, there's some nice momentum to this level. This is fun. I'm having fun. Whoa! No fun anymore. Bullshit. You know, you're standing too fucking close to me. All right. Try again. Precision platforming. Getting. Pfft. Really wanted the K. Can I get it? Can I be a fucking dick about this and get it? 
<laughs> the greed. Oh man, that was awesome. I'm gonna clip that and highlight it. Hey, oh my god, I totally almost would have missed all of this. Whatever's over here. over there? I don't think so. Nice! DK coin! Let's see if I can scroll the camera any further. I can't. Okay. That was awesome! <laughs> the surprise in your voice as you say I'm having fun. Yeah, I... <laughs> Excellent gameplay. Uh, this game is stressful. Fun, but stressful. Alright, let's try and get the K this time. It was not that difficult. I was just making it so hard. <sighs> let's get the coin too. Okay, this was the bullshit. Ah! Everything's fine. Oh, he's gonna go down. Is he though? Oh my god, look at that sneaky little bitch! Weak ass sneak- Hey! How the fuck did we miss the spider? <laughs> how is that possible? Did anybody see how that could be possible? Wow. Oh, it summons them. All right, let's get the coin. Okay, we gotta go. Panic. Panic. <laughs> oh, pff. there's a leap of faith. Ah, I just like sort of slid off the edge of the motherfucker. I hit the button, but ah. fuck your life. <laughs> when they when you beat them and they have the little voices. Oh, there was a bonus coin. I didn't even I didn't even need the fucking spider, but I wonder how you get the spider. Oh, this is awesome. Do we have the... Do we have the spider now? Maybe that's how you get the spider. Was that a stripper enemy? I'm sorry, what was that? Hey! Cool. <laughs> that is correct, actually, yes. It was a strip pole enemy. These boys gotta work. They gotta get that money. It's hard life out here in the wall. Hard life in the in the wall. Oh, horrible! Come on, Alex. Oh, you can land on him. Cool. I thought you couldn't. Nose is itching. Ah! Stress is happening. <laughs> Wait. Didn't get it. Wow. Okay. Go back and see. Hey, hey, we got almost everything. We got all the bonuses just at the DK coin. We're doing pretty good on, on actually completing or 100%ing this area. Oh, I needed a, I need a ditty, see? Something up there to get. Something up there. Damn. Sugar. 
Dude, there's a sword in the map. It's the same background. All right. Come on, snake. This is fun. Music really helps with this level. Well, impressively bad display of gaming. But we should have the ability now to, yes. Get this bonus, which is nice. Hmm. You know, you're standing you see these dogs close in the front yard? Huh. Just know upstairs I'm going hard. Bing bong. Easy every time. As long as you're having fun, as long as you made friends along the way, you should do whatever makes you happy. One of my favorite things about the soundtrack is the way that David Wise seamlessly transitions from you know, like, this song has, like, no sense of it being synthetic, you know? It doesn't feel like a synth song. It's all, like, organic instruments. And then they'll have songs like Mining Melancholy or the Bramble song or Forest Interlude that was playing at the beginning of the stream that are just totally, total bops. I feel like I am maybe missing bonuses. Nice. There we go. All right, we gotta find some suit. Oh my God. I like how they changed up the uh, level though and put it like kind of the, the top. I cannot believe that was pathetic, Al. <gasps> shot. Hey, Skippin' Bees. That's why they call me Alex Skippin' Bees Dalliance. Woo! Let's see what's on over here. Nothing up there. Okay. Why did I? Okay, good. Good. Just <laughs> abandon that. The the letters are such a troll, except in the very earliest levels. It's so easy to die trying to get them. And if you get all four of them, you get a bonus. Or you get a bonus life. It's just the, the equation doesn't make any sense. Ah! Just like going for that coin. There was no point in me going for the coin. It wasn't worth it. I did it anyways. Just like that. I was so tempted to go for the end, just because it's like in your nature to try to collect all the things. The sea shanty song, guys, yeah, so good. Some context for my middle name. <laughs> Ryan, that's hilarious. Okay, here we go. Oh. <coughs> this is bad. Oh, no. Oh, come on! Nice. Oh, that was stressful. That was like one of the first stressful bonuses I've played so far. I don't fucking like you.
Precision gaming. No TK coin, though. I feel like I might be... Alright, just use patience. Such a silly thing the snake does. Look at how silly that is. Ah, that was hot garbage. DK coin, or the uh, Diddy was, or the DK coin for that matter. Yeah, it was. We got what? So what do we have so far? We don't have Glimmer or Rattle Battles DK coin, but we've got all the bonuses so far. It's really cool. Really cool. Slime climb. Oh, I love the top sale levels. Oh, I remember this one, though, with this goddamn fish. It's a race against the ocean. Oof. Is that all you got, game? Oh, it's still going. Oh, it's not stopping. Oh, good. Perfect. Great. Please get out of the water. Oh, and I needed some hotness right there. Come on, up the rope. Whoa, this level's tough. This level's tough. This is gonna be a thing. I'm going in here just to get a... DK barrel. I can't remember if there was one in the beginning, but I just wanted to have uh, something so we could get up to that. Bonus. The Wellerman. What's the Wellerman? I need help. All for nothing. God, I'm hot. Garbage. Not hot. Garbage. Oh, there is one. Okay, cool. This is not good. Very bad. Start select. This is chaos. How did I fuck this up? Okay, at least I'll do one of these. Please go. Full of hate. Full of hate. It's a sea shanty. Soon, soon may the Wellerman come to bring us sugar, tea, and rum. It's a popular song that's not technically a sea shanty, but everyone classifies it as one. Don't get me wrong, I love it, but it ain't a sea shanty. What's the definition of a sea, of a sea shanty, Ryan? If I can use words out of my breath hole and chords in my throat to speak, not idiot. Smart good. Alright, just fast is not the move, apparently. Uh, actually, it wasn't terrible. I am... Why would that happen? Why would that be in the game for that to happen? We're gonna miss this stupid fuck. Stupid lizards. Right? That was fair. I can't believe I dodged it. Please go, sir. What is happening here? 
faster than the speed of light. Skipping the DK barrel. <laughs> totally missing all the bonuses. Yep, would have had another fucking bonus had I not skipped the DK barrel. We're just having some fun here. Just... <laughs> Good thing I ate that. Good thing. Good thing. Ah! Okay, so there's clearly a barrel up there. Oh, are you kidding? I thought that we were supposed to get up there. What are we supposed to do? What am I supposed to be doing? This is good. I don't even know where I'm going. Where is home? Uh, this is bad. This is bad. Yeah. <laughs> this is very hard to know that this is going out on the internet. As a, as like, this is how good Alex is. <laughs> that jump scared me. And uh, now it's all over. <laughs> Sea shanties were songs with call and responses that were broken up into two categories. Shanties for the slow, heavy work, and ones for quick, light work. They were enjoyable ways to keep time. Songs they would sing during labor. They were supposed to keep everyone in sync on tasks similar to military cadences. I believe that the song brings to mind sailing on the deep blue sea. Yo, what's up, Barb? How do you feel about this? Okay, so invincibility is total garbage. Come on, baby. Daddy's going. Going fast. Eating it. Going fast. Just do this. <laughs> Song is very good. No. Mm -hmm. This is some hate right here. Ugh. Jackie, before you knock the electric slide to keep time with your coworkers, you should try it because it's awesome. It really helps with the manual labor. All right, ape. Show me what you got. It hurts. All right, come on. Don't get jump scared this time. Just run. Well. Got one bonus. Oh my gosh. <laughs> yeah, me and Ray singing the doing the electric slide. Hey, hey, that's good. Nice. Nice. Hmm. Well, that wasn't what I was trying to do either. I was trying to do this. Oh, man. Look at that. They show it to you. They rub it in your fucking face. Fine. This level was something else. Okay. Bramble... <laughs> Forgot about Bramble Blast. Some shit. Oh, and we've got, uh... Clubba. We'll come back to Clubba later, I think. Think we got enough lives? 
Oh yeah, here we go. This song reminds me of my childhood. Really cool the way that David Wise was able to take the Korg wave station and put it into this game. So the way this works, I've probably mentioned to it most streams, but the different... You can hear how that sounds like the filter's getting brighter. That sound. But of course, the uh, there is no analog filter in the SNES, so what it is is it's a recording of a filter or of a synthesizer with the filter at different points, and then they're sequenced to sound like everything's okay. <laughs> but of course, everything's not okay. Got a nice barrel maze here. Yeah, it's so good. We're we supposed to go up here? No. There we go. So beautiful. Beautiful piece of music. What am I doing? Come on. This is good. This is just fucking great. <sighs> this is gonna be a problem. a halfway point. It is nice that they put the most, like, relaxing song, though, in, like, the most stressful level. Yes! Sweet. I think there might have been a bonus up there to the left of the, uh, the halfway barrel, but what are you gonna do now? Hey, hey! Don't you try to get away from me, you little sneaky bitch. Just make it more complicated, why don't you? Such a beautiful piece of music, though. Wait, wait, wait. Let's go back this way. I think I saw something. Here we go. Oh. There's a dead end, I think. Hey, DK coin up there. Let's try to remember that when we come back around. Oh, I don't know why that didn't kill me. I think I missed the everything. Well, 
Well, we made it through. Didn't get shit, though. Okay, so we made it to the boss. Let's go save. We'll leave all of the, um, swanky stuff for next time. Okay. This is looking good, guys. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and check this out now. What do we need to get? DK coin in glimmers. Go above the entrance to bonus area one, then swim right to a secret chamber with the three made of bananas. Swim all the way to the right. Okay. So I think it's just in the beginning. Bonus area one. We'll just go up here. But perhaps you can keep swimming? Oh, wow. That's pretty crazy. Okay. How do we get on to the next area here? There's a two. Oh, look at this. It's the secret walls here. These bananas are nice too. There she is. Easy every time. Crackhead, we're good. Rattle battle. Where's that DK coin? At the start, take out the cutlass, then hit the upper zinger with the DK barrel. If you hit the lower by mistake, use a careful helicopter spin to collide. Oh wait, no, 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 wrong one. Rattle battle. See the zinger after the letter O, protected by a barrel stack? Deal with him first, then dash off the stack. Dash off the stack or the edge of the lower deck. At top speed, jumping in midair as you fall to find your hero corn. Marked by a lone banana. Alright, I don't have no idea what that means, but let's go ahead and give it a shot. Come on. We're looking for the O. Really don't need anything else. Protected by a barrel stack. Deal with them first and dash off of this stack. Or at the edge of the lower deck at top speed, jumping in midair as you fall to find your hero coin. Interesting. Hmm, that was not it. After the letter O, protected by a barrel stack. It was after the O. That was my bad. I've read it out to you guys so many times and it didn't click. Alright guys, this 100% happening. One oh two percent incoming. Like this gaming has become more precision. What do you guys think? <laughs> I hate myself. <laughs> Can't believe I said that. <laughs> that was a, that was not intentional, guys.
We're getting so many coins from that bee. And death. We're looking for a bee protected by a barrel stack. Definitely more precise. Deal with them first, then dash off this stack or the edge of the lower deck at top speed, jumping in midair as you fall to find your hero point. Ah, there it is! Ah, oh, I'm so stupid. Classic stupid Alex Dalliance. We're almost there, guys. Stick with me. We're gonna make it. We saw it, at least. We're just flying along here. See how the camera kind of lags behind there. At a top speed. I don't know if this is exactly top speed. Nice! Got it. <sighs> don't beat yourself up, Vault. We like our jobs. All right, slime climb, we didn't get everything. Uh, okay, let's read what we got here. DK coin at the place where the barrel cannon spits you out. Team throw to the explanation mark barrel above you. Now charge to the exit target as fast as you can without landing in any barrel canyons and dive up in the water under it. <laughs> Swim to the right. We saw it at the end there. Yay! <laughs> Stomp cartwheel or spin attack the cannon right past the continue barrel as he pauses and get the explanation barrel he covered up. Now jump into the water and follow bananas downward. Interesting. So you actually have to get to the continue barrel. And then two is once you find the cannonball, get it to the bonus cannon without dropping into the water. So we did that, right? I think we already did that. So we just have to worry about... We gotta get... All we have to do is get to the continue. And then, I remember that explanation barrel, ex, not explanation, exclamation. Use your brain, Alex, like a smart. This motherfucker. So interestingly, the stuff I thought was the bonus wasn't. Really, all that matters is getting to the no rush everything's fine to the continue barrels all we really need to worry about there we are and then there's this guy and jump into the water and follow the stuff downward okay Nice! That was cool. Collecting stars. This is good. Oh, I missed one. Two. Sugar. Nice! Woo! That was good.
Okay, we got that. And then so basically at the end, take a second and read. The place where the barrel cannon spits you out. Bonus cannon spits you out. Team throw to the explanation mark barrel above you. Okay. So maybe we do go for the, um... Wow, Alex. That was something. Yeah, we did get all the bonuses. Cool. We're looking for that explanation mark. It's kind of nice to know that nothing really matters until the end. Playing a little cavalier here. But it's because I know I'm like kind of in the clear. Gotcha, I'm scared, I forgot. Wish I had a DK barrel. Right in the face. It's okay. It's all good. We're getting there. If you see these dogs in your front yard, <laughs> we're getting there. Just know upstairs I'm going hard. Bing bong. Let's try to keep the shit happening this time. Word of God, it's like asking for it. <sighs> Just eating it. Just fucking getting you know, it. You're standing too fucking close to me. Oh, Jackie, you haven't gotten the whole bing bong train. Honestly, I need some new sound effects because the, the hype of uh, that video went out, but um, pretty sure if you just search, um, it might work if you just search Bing Bong because it, in YouTube, the video will come up. It's a minute long video from Side Talk about Coney Island. And one thing that I appreciate about this video is in like our modern landscape where we're all like kind of afraid to make jokes. It's like really kind of brings it back to the core of just like laughing at people, but um, they are fucked in Coney Island and it's fucking amazing. It's like the the most uh, incredible minute of shenanigans you're ever going to hear. And um, the phrase bing bong came from that uh, for whatever reason. I think it's a, uh, it's because of the subway in New York. Don't fuck, oh, I fucked it. And the, it's still going too. Okay, whatever. Let's keep moving. Okay. I really need to fucking focus on what this is saying. Charge the exit target as fast as you can without landing in any barrel cannons and dive into the water under it. All right. Let's try. Dive into the water. Done. Got it, got it, got it. Boom, man, it's looking good. All right, Bramble Blast. Let's see. Get Squawks. Somehow you get the parrot in here. Um. Wow, all of these are complicated. Get squawks, fly up and left to a single yellow zinger flying up and down to protect a small chamber. Oof. Don't bounce the level's only formation of four flitters except the first one, then bounce off him left into the gap below. We'll shoot you into squawks' talons. All right. Once you land in a two-way barrel cannon with an 
arrow barrel pointing to it from the upper right. Stop. That's... uh Uh-oh. Once you land in a two-way barrel cannon... Two-way barrel cannon. Okay, I think that's those ones that go like that. Right? Pointing to it from the upper right. Stop. What follows is a direct line to the bonus barrel, so pay attention to these instructions. From the two-way barrel cannon I mentioned earlier, fire to the upper left, then to the upper right. You should be inside a four-way barrel cannon up to this point. Shoot upward, upward right from here, launching yourself downward right soon after. Are you in a three-way barrel cannon with thorns to your lower right? If you are, shoot to the upper right and the upper left. There should be a diagonal path bananas to your upper left and an arrow barrel which points directly at you to your upper right. Jesus fuck. Fire upward left twice, then downward left straight into an arrow barrel which takes you to a two-way barrel cannon. Instead of firing at the lower right barrel cannon to proceed through the banana trail out of the chamber, fire downward left and downward right and finally downward left. That wasn't so hard, was it? Oh my god. Get squawks. Okay, so we gotta worry about getting squawks, and to get squawks, we gotta worry for four flitters. Oh my gosh. Yeah, it would be fun. I think there is a way to do that. Um, That would be better, just to get the noises going. Alright. This is gonna be punishing. Once you land in a two-way barrel cannon with an arrow arrow barrel pointing to it from the upper right. I don't know. Not good. Is this it? Two-way barrel with an arrow barrel pointing to it from the upper right. I don't think from the upper right. Upper right. No, nope, don't think that's it. Yikes. Into the barrel, please. Thank you. Two way barrel with an. <laughs> with the. Arrow barrel pointing to it from the upper right. We're here. This is some bullshit. This is hot garbage. Fire to the upper left. Then the upper right. Shoot upward right from here. I have to like... Downward right. I think I'm fucked up. Oh yeah, no, no. Okay, upper right. And then upper left. Should be a diagonal line of bananas to your upper left. Sorry, it's so hard to like, not lose my place. And then an arrow barrel to your upper right. Fire upward left twice. Then downward left, straight into an arrow barrel. Which takes you to a two-way barrel cannon. Instead of firing at the lower right barrel cannon, fire downward left, then downward right, and finally downward left. Whoops. Downward left, downward right, finally downward left. 
Nice. God, that is fucking ridiculous. How the fuck are you ever supposed to figure that out? I didn't even figure that I had to figure this out. Oh no. Come on, baby. Yeah! That's what I'm talking about. <sighs> Big dog dalliance. Big dog dalliance. Okay. Oh, I totally fucked that up, I think. I'm kind of doing the same thing. But I guess you go this way. Here we go. There we go. The smell of freedom. Alright. Uh, get squawks. Alright, so let's pay attention. Okay, so we gotta find the four flitters. Oof. Man, the stress. It's fucked up. But you know what's good is the precision gaming. When they start spinning like this, it is such horseshit. Oh, are you kidding me? Fuck me. Anybody see any fucking flitters? Off him to the left of the gap below. That was only one flitter. Oh man, there was, there was no time to react. A flitter was the uh, the um, dragonfly. That's what I should have said. Dragonfly. It's just the in-game name for the dragonflies. This barrel maze shit is horseshit. Don't love it. Do we love it? No, we don't love it. Uh, let's try and see if I can keep some fucking apes. Immediate failure. Just skip some of this shit right here. Can we just, yeah, get into this? There we go. I uh, just skip, yeah, <laughs> skip that whole section.
Okay. Squawks is up there to the left. Yeah, the music is so good. Get Squawks and fly the upper passage you find him in until you find a single red zinger circling around. Evade him. Fly down the shaft below until you land in an auto-fire barrel. Inevitably, you'll get in without getting choked by the thorns around that narrow shaft. Okay, so look for the red B and then uh, the DK coin. Get Squawks when... Um, then fly up and left to a single yellow zinger flying up and down to protect a small chamber. Alright, so... Nice. Thank God. Thank fucking God. Oh, didn't even think about being good. I'm just accidentally hitting that button because of the panic. Nice. Oh my God, fuck. I think that's it, guys. I think that's it for this whole world. World 3? Okay, let's double check. Bramble Blast. Slime Climb. Rattle Battle. Crockhead. Glimmers. And Barrel Bayou. So, you know what that means? We have successfully 100%ed this. All we have left is the boss which I think is a great way to start the next uh, stream because the boss, like, if we beat him, we won't be able to save any, uh, any progress, unfortunately. Right, because we we'll just move on to the next area. So Cudgel's pretty easy, I remember. So guys, thank you so much for hanging out with me tonight. This stream went a lot better than the last one, and I'm really excited. The next two worlds, like, the next world is the, um, like roller coaster theme park world. And then the one after that is like the Enchanted Misty Woods. They're my two favorite worlds from the game. They're just incredible. And i uh, really excited for that. Hopefully we'll get through a world, world and a half next time, something like that. I think we had a good stream tonight. It was a good, nice length. So anyways, guys, love all of you very much. Hope you have a wonderful night and I'll see you next Wednesday at 9 p.m. You guys, uh. Have a good whatever you call a thing between Wednesdays. A week, I suppose. If you see these dogs in your front yard, huh, just know upstairs I'm going hard. Bing bong. <laughs>